Hi guys, my name is Tristan and today we're going to be talking about the rear delts. It's one of three heads of the shoulder. It's just in the back here. And it's one of the often overlooked parts of the shoulder that people just will not train. Um, it contributes to various uh, functions of the shoulder. It even helps recruit the lats. And its main function is actually horizontal abduction. Okay, so what people tend to do is they tend to get on the bench, they put their chest on it, they kind of just fly away. What they don't realize is that the range of motion at the shoulder isn't quite large. You get to about here, and as soon as you try to pass that, your shoulder blade's gonna take over, you're gonna start recruiting your mid traps and your rhomboids. So a little trick next time you do your rear delt flies is to grab a much lighter weight, say an eight pound dumbbell, and when you get on the bench, you're actually gonna walk yourself forward and protract your shoulder blades over the bench, which is not gonna allow you to use them, like this. And then what you're gonna do is you're just going to fly away while pushing your shoulder blades forward. You're gonna see I don't have a huge range of motion here. You can turn your hands out as well. It has more or less the same effect. Play around with that. Let us know what you think.